you know it, Mr. John Calipari drops a bomb mm. on us. Thank goodness for old uh, what he's calling a basketball school up there in Lexington. How, I mean, how disrespectful <laughs> is that? Yeah, the hell, Hatfield McCoy. We got the damn basketball versus the football team up there in Kentucky, man. <laughs> it's like a family feud. Yeah, and uh. it, if you missed it, I mean, we'll, we'll throw it up here on the YouTube channel, but uh, this is not, you know, Shane and I just, just making something up. I mean, Mark Stoops seems like mm-hmm. he's pissed. He's out here retweeting all these these people saying that uh, Kentucky's a football school. We got Vince Morrow, uh, of course, tweeting. We we can't have a Kentucky story without old Vince <laughs> tweeting something. He's tweeting uh-huh. it out. Former, the best one, though, I saw, Shane, I don't know if you've seen this one. Former Kentucky punter Max Duffy, he says, has the football team ever lost to St. Peter's in the NCAA <laughs> tournament? Because we know Coach Cal has. So, oh, man, this is uh, Kentucky eating its own oh. up here, isn't it? Godly, and I tell you, as a as you hate it. I mean, you absolutely hate it if you're a Kentucky fan. This is not the publicity you need, but man, if you're not a Kentucky fan, this is the publicity <laughs> you want. <laughs> yeah, and everybody I've, recruiting against Stoops on the recruiting yeah, trail. Yeah, just, I mean, just came out of nowhere. This. Yeah, I just this is again. You've got to work together, and and, and you know it's. It, you know that whole it's a basketball school. It's not anymore, man. I mean, when you keep putting up ten win seasons, it's 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 both. You know, and and I just like that Mark's finally saying, "Hey, okay, easy." <laughs> you know, right? Well, that that may have worked ten years ago, but it isn't working now because we are paying our own bills. Mm-hmm. And like I said, I mean this. You know, fair or not, Shane, that this is the perception that's outside of Lexington already. That Kentucky mm-hmm. is just a basketball school. I get, you know, I, I do a lot of these interviews. They say, "Well, when is Kentucky going to start regressing? How long before Mark Stoops jumps to a bigger school?" And this ain't helping when it's coming no. from within the building, where it, it's that outside perception is is leaking into the building here. And I think that's why Mark Stoops and Vince Morrow and the, and the rest of the the program is so pissed. And, and I think they deserve the right to be. Yeah. No, I I, I totally agree and. And and this is just I don't know maybe this is uh, we don't know what's going behind the scenes but clearly these programs are not on the same page you love to see when they are you know I I remember not too long ago we would see Bruce Pearl up in the football stands we'd see you know uh, uh, other head coaches uh, what's his name was just down there uh, at LSU Kelly. You know, I mean, this, this is what you need. You, you need these programs because you you you're advertising for for them. You know, when right. when basketball recruits are up, they're taking them to football games, and when football recruits are up, you can take them to basketball games. It's it's you got to work together. And, and I understand Kentucky is a has got the 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 stigma that it's a a basketball program, and maybe they feel like they don't need the football team. But man, it's just not good for the brand. No, it's it's definitely not. And I thought what you were going to say, Shane, is I remember it wasn't that long ago they were, you know, giving giveaways at the Walmart parking lot. Remember <laughs> yeah. to, to get fans to show up to the game. That's right. But we've turned the corner. We've got I Mark Stoops done a hell of a lot better job than John Calipari the last couple of seasons mm-hmm. here with two ten win seasons. That is just incredibly difficult to do in, in today's SEC landscape on the gridiron. And hey, newsflash for Calipari it is great as a coach as he may be, and, and basketball is, is big up there in Kentucky, basketball makes about 25% of what football makes across the sports landscape of college. So Say, uh, say that one more time and a little slower, Mike, so Cal Park <laughs> can hear this. Basketball makes about 25%. If it and this is a good program on on, on non good programs, it's even less compared to seventy five percent of the budget that football brings in. So hey, keep running your mouth and hey, if, if push comes to sh- shove, Shane, I, I hope it doesn't come to this for Kentucky's sake. But they may get to a point where they say, well, Mark Stoops or John Calipari. And as crazy as this may have been to say, you know, four or five years ago. I think mm-hmm. they would pick Mark Stoops because of what he's done to the football <laughs> program and, and the future of that thing, whereas John Calipari has got all these recruits and he can't do 
a damn thing with them. Mike, this is Cousin Shane. This ain't Paul Feinbaum. You don't. You can hold <laughs> off on the hot takes here. I mean, do, do they really? Do you really think that that's the case? I mean, obviously, Kentucky basketball is not where. And this isn't a. We are a football podcast. <laughs> We're not a, uh, to kind of steal from Calipari. We are we are a one trick pony here, yeah. And, and and I'm not trying to get into basketball, but but man, I don't think I, I don't think Kentucky fans are extremely pleased with the way that program has been going here of late. And it, it you know I've heard rumblings of maybe we try something a little different up there. It should be an easy job to recruit for. So right. Man, I, I don't, maybe you're not nuts there. I mean, if, if it came to, I'd love to put a poll up and see. Uh, but I, I would be curious if if it push came to shove, if they had to get rid of one, do you take a program that has been in the bottom of the cellar, man? I'm t- I mean, Kentucky games, you you gave tickets away. That's right. I, I hate to say it, right. but w- growing up, if you wanted a free home game and then you found out it was a kentucky you're like oh okay i see why it's free now you know now right, it's not right. like that it's it's a it's a freaking rivalry with a lot of programs not just tennessee but the louisville's but the florida's it's, it's just they're competitive but mark took them from there he took them from the basement and he's made them a a, a competitive football program and i don't see that changing anytime soon and the basketball team if you ask me has taken a step back here the last few years so you may be on something here man yeah and if i'm wrong about kentucky and hell i probably will be especially after i disrespected (laughs) them and now calipari's disrespecting them if they go out here and beat florida and beat tennessee and they finish second in the east yeah it's a no-brainer yeah, I would That's keep right. Stoops over Calipari, no no doubt. Or at least give him his parking spot, you know, make his ass <laughs> walk a little bit further <laughs> in his fancy shoes, you know. 